Okay, so I done a video the other day and I never got around to posting it. And so I got some, I got really pissed off in the video, so I didn't want to post it because I was saying a lot of bad stuff. But the um, video camera here that I have, I lost the original charger for it. It plugs into it, the AC wall charger. And um, so I ordered a new one and it's an aftermarket charger which is this one here well it doesn't work this charger does not work any other other charges that I have does not work it's got a plug on it like this and when you plug it in the little blue light will come on in a flash twice and goes off so I thought well, what the hell's wrong with this thing you know so I researched and looked online and everyone that's ever bought an aftermarket charger like this, the wall charger, it does not work with a Toshiba camera. So, I wasted 15 bucks on a AC wall charger. So that's garbage. I'm going to keep it. If somebody needs it, I'll give it to them because, I mean, I don't, I don't need it. So, I was in Walmart the other day and had a brain fart, okay? I was over there, I was looking for chargers, and I thought, well, let me see if I can find a charger like this. My I buy one at Walmart. Of course, they didn't have anything. So, I was over there looking around, and I had a brain fart. And I actually had two brain farts. One was I thought, well, maybe I can go. I can hear it. Oh, my black there fell. The wind's blowing here real bad. So, I thought, maybe I'll get one in. Things you plug in the wall, it's got the USB chargers on it. I thought, well, I'm not going to pay $25 for a damn plug in. So I'll come back around the island window, back over there by the cameras and stuff, and I had a brain fart. I thought, wait a minute. What if I buy another camera? And I thought, why would I want to buy another camera when I have one? And I don't need another one. I've got plenty of cameras. Then that's when it dawned on me. The battery in this camera comes out. You can remove the battery. And I thought back to my old 8 millimeter. Eight mil yeah, it was 8 millimeter. It was little tapes like this. I thought back to that camera and I thought, hmm. I had a charger that you put, put the battery on and you plug it into the wall. Maybe they make one like that. That on the internet. So, back to this for a minute. These don't work because these are not wired the same way the camera is. That's why they don't work. So, I went to Walmart.com. After researching, and you can buy wall chargers. They plug into the wall. So, this one pops on the back like that. You hook your battery on there. I can hook it on here, right? See? Your battery pops on there. Plug that in the wall and you can charge it, okay? Well, it's got a big damn cat hair on it. There it is. So, I thought, well, that's what I need. That'll work. So, I got to looking even more. And this one was thirty, was $25 and $5 shipping, okay? But you got the charger. You got two other, two additional batteries with it. Here's the um, another battery, and here's the other the other battery that come with it. And um, they, it, it works. So I didn't plug it into my camera. Plus, if I ever travel out of the country, which I don't plan on, it comes with a European plug adapter. I don't really need that. I don't guess. But this was the other thing that kind of sold me on this charger. With an outlet charger, you can plug it into the car. So if I'm out with my camera and I need to charge a battery, I can use this. I can charge my camera battery in my car. I thought it was pretty cool. So, order this. It just came in the mail today. And, um, I have something popping up on my screen. Hang on. Sorry. So that come in the mail today. It works. So I have three batteries now for my Toshiba camera. 
So I've been filming with this thing. I've got two 16 gigabyte SD cards. I think they're 16 gigabytes. They are. And I have two of those. You can record like two hours and 45 minutes on them on those cards. So I can record it for six hours and not have to worry about you know uploading stuff on my computer yet. So that that's it's working perfect. So I have found the solution. Finally, I have found my solution to this. So for 30 bucks, I have two brand new batteries and a charger. And I'm happy with it. Yay. So, I'm tickled, as you can tell. Now I can start doing uh, movies again. Yay. I've got another camera that I could that I could do movies with, but it's a really, like, bad quality camera. It's an older camera. Mini DVD camera, so it's not the best camera. So, now I have this one and my GoPro that I'm still using. I'll show you my GoPro. I was telling uh, my friend Marty, he was talking, <clears throat> he was doing a live chat and he was having a yard sale. <clears throat> this is my GoPro here. And see, you can't, you don't know what you're filming. The only thing you can do is you press a little button here and it says if it's recording or not. So you can't see what you're filming with this. You can download the GoPro app, but I can't ever get to sync up with my damn GoPro. And plus, when you do that, it runs the battery dead faster. So, anyway, so, now that we have the solution to the battery issue, I can start doing some more videos using my green screen. So, y'all can keep an eye out for that. Alright, so, I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out, and later.